Hello friends, welcome to Mr. How To. Today we are going to see how to rename and change the format of multiple files. It's often a tedious job when you have a lot of files in your folder and you have to change the name of each file and also you have to change the format for these files. And it takes a lot of your time if you are visiting each and every file and doing so one by one. Today I am going to tell you one trick which will help you fix this problem in five minutes. So let's get started. So this is a folder by the name bulk files, which contains total seven number of files. The first thing what you have to do is that the number of files which are there in the folder, you have to save this folder in your C drive under the user folder like this. So you get the path like this. This PC, local C drive, users, and bulk files. All right. After doing this, you have to copy this file path and paste it in your Google Chrome in URL space over here, like this. Press enter, you get the enter index C value for these files, which contains the name, size, and date modified. So I'm just going to press the control A and control C, basically copying this and going to paste it over here in my Excel like this. So now I'm going to remove the unwanted part, which is not required here for me. So now you can clearly see these are total seven number of files. So this is also one of the tricks where you have to list down the number of files in the folders in Excel. So you don't have to check each and every folder name and note it down in Excel one by one. You just have to do is that you have to ship this folder in C drive and then copy that file path and paste it in your Google Chrome URL path and paste it over here in Excel like I did. Cool, right? So what next we are going to do is we are going to do some arrangements with it. So now I'm going to add this like this. I want this at the end of this name. So I'm going to use concatenate function to combine these two values. All right. I will apply to all the values like this. Then I will copy this and paste it over here and I will remove whatever the calculations I had in terms of the rearrangements. So now this is the data on which I have to work. So basically this is the list of file or data which I need to change. Right. So let's say I am renaming these files by the days of week. Let's say I'm going to rename first file by the name one day then use day and let's see after dragging we get this all right so monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday so i want the names of these files by this name right and i want the format for these files as dot doc so I will write it over here dot doc and then we'll use the sign. Let's say I have to convert this XLS X file into docs X file. So I will type it like this by writing over here. And let's say other files in doc format only. So I will simply paste it like this. I will add this sign. And again, to combine all three, I will use the concatenate function. I will apply to all these entries to copy this and paste it over here like this. I will remove the rearrangements what I did. And I will name this column as name one. Okay. 
So name one is the rename file name which are required with particular format. Okay. So new Microsoft Excel worksheet copy to Excel as X format will now turn to Monday dot doc format okay so in that way all these seven files will turn up so to do that the third step you have to do is that you have to write here ren and type assign and then you have to copy this file path which you did earlier and now you have to paste it over here and then this sign now again to combine three values you have to use concatenate function so like this i am using it i will also keep a little space between these two and will put a dollar sign before five and c so that going forward for the all values the values doesn't change takes this value as a constant value right so now we have arrived up till here which is a one step to arrive at our desired output so now what you have to do is that you have to copy this and now you have to open your command prop and then you have to simply paste it here like this and the magic has happened now you can check your folder and you will see that the bulk files with these seven files by these names were there are now changed with this name and this format you want to check see now friday and it is in the document dot do doc format this is xls format and all this has been changed isn't that cool this is a master workout you can apply to the n number of files and you can save you a lot of time and you can basically work out smartly over here right so thank you very much for watching our channel and keep watching mr how